Hello King Gamers and welcome to another review. This time we have the NT68 wireless mechanical keyboard from Apple Maker. So let's jump straight in. NT68 is not just another compact keyboard and the sum of its parts creates a great whole. It screams quality right out of the box as it feels weighty, offers absolutely no flex and its keys are completely rattle free. The top plate and the sides here are made of aluminium while the bottom is plastic. Sure, some of the weight here is due to the internal battery but the great build quality of this keyboard can't be denied. In terms of its size footprint, it's designed to be portable and used with multiple devices. That's not to say you can't use it solely with your desktop PC, but you get the most value out of this keyboard by using it with multiple devices. First and foremost, Apple Maker designed it so you can place it directly atop your laptop's keyboard so that it doesn't press on the built-in buttons. The intention here is for you to get that fully mechanical typing experience instead of using the traditional laptop keys. Now, while you can make this work with 15-inch laptops, it will definitely be most ideal for 14-inch or even smaller laptops that don't have a numpad. In terms of portability and NT68 being a full package, it comes with its beautiful magnetic case to protect the keyboard and prevent accidental presses if you put it inside a bag. Not only that, but it also acts as a stand for your portable devices, as well as a tilting mechanism since the keyboard doesn't have built-in feet of its own. The case even serves as a solid sound dampener, making typing while using it even more enjoyable. Apple Maker gives you a choice of your preferred Gatoron switch or one of their very own chocolate switches. If that doesn't tickle your fancy, however, don't worry. The NT68 is hot swappable, so you can easily customize it with any other switch of your choosing. I went with their red chocolate linear switches with 45 grams of actuation force and an actuation point of around 2 mm, which is a great choice if you want both a great typing and gaming experience. The combination of the switches, lubing and some internal dampening often made the keyboard feel very premium, almost to a keyboard enthusiast level, which is most evident in how satisfying it sounds. So here's a small sound test so you can hear it for yourself. As with some of their other keyboards, here you once again have the excellent die sublimated PBT keycaps, so you can forget about them wearing out or getting oily after prolonged usage. They are made in Apple Maker's GK profile, so they have a bit of a curve to make them easier to type on. They are also 20% shorter than regular high profile keycaps, so the keyboard appears even more compact in general. What's more, our review unit came in this nice grey color with red on the escape and arrow keys to make the entire keyboard visually pop out. Most keys also have dark red icons, so you can easily differentiate between their main and alternate function. All in all, the quality of the keycaps is top notch, both in terms of build and look. One small gripe that takes some time to get used to is the fact that Apple Maker switched the position of control and function keys, which can cause some accidental presses, especially when gaming. Of course the keyboard has RGB and it looks great if a bit subdued when compared to some more known competitors. This is mostly due to the fact that the stock keycaps don't have the lights shining through the legends, but I feel like this is appropriate for the type of keyboard NT68 is trying to be. Of course, you have your standard array of beautiful, smoothly animated effects built into the keyboard and if you want to go a step further, you can customize them even more in the accompanying software. The real magic of NT68 is its versatility in terms of connectivity. 
It offers a Type-C wired connection, but you can also use Bluetooth 5.1 to connect to up to three different devices, making it the perfect traveling companion. You can seamlessly cycle between devices with a simple shortcut and the switch between them will happen in just 2-3 to three seconds. The keyboard remembers the connected device and the connection is absolutely rock solid and reliable to a standard Bluetooth range. There's functionally no input delay when using Bluetooth for typing and you should even be fine using it for some casual gaming. Of course, just to be safe, I'd still recommend a wired connection if you intend on using it for competitive multiplayer of any kind. If you still decide to go for wireless, the 1900mAh battery should enable you to keep going for quite some time. Without the RGB, I managed around a substantial 2 weeks of fairly heavy usage using the keyboard for full-time work and gaming. This can stretch out to around 4 or even 5 weeks if you're the type of user that gets in only 2-3 to three hours of daily usage. Of course, this drops dramatically if you turn the lights on to max brightness and here you can expect around 40-60 to 60 hours, which is still fairly impressive. One thing to note is that the keyboard doesn't have a battery indicator, so you'll be at a loss when trying to gauge how much juice you have left. One thing where Epo Maker somewhat stumbles is the software. It's really robust in terms of features and function if you figure out how to do any of it. The user interface of the software is needlessly convoluted, requiring a fair amount of trial and error to get anything done. Of course, it can be used to customize the RGB as well as the function of every key, save profiles and record macros, but how you do it isn't intuitive at all and is something EpoMaker really needs to work on in order to catch up to other big name brands. All in all, I can safely say that MT68 is another success for EpoMaker. Despite some nitpicky issues and unintuitive software, everything else about this keyboard is basically top notch. So if you're in the market for a compact, portable, good looking and versatile keyboard at around a $100 price point, this is the one you really can't go wrong with. If you like what you've seen in this video, as always, the product link will be included in the description down below. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe to Keen Gamer for more reviews just like this one.